food while watching The Bachelorette Portrait Night. I forgot to say good morning to you guys, so good morning! Uh, I'm at work, so I'm walking into work, so I can't talk for long, but man, this was a long weekend, and I feel bad because I got way behind on the vlogs, so I actually didn't upload on Sunday. I'm uploading this morning, uh, Sunday's vlog, so I feel bad, but I think I already mentioned this in the other day's video, uh, but, you know, it happens, life happens, and it's not about making... Basically, the way I'm looking at it is, I'm uploading a vlog, or shooting a vlog every day. I may be late in uploading it, it may be uploaded the next morning, that, that's gonna happen. But, I'm filming every single day, so every single day of my life is still documented. Um, and that's kind of the goal, so, even though it's a late upload and I feel bad about it, I'm still getting a vlog up every single day. Uh, and, you know what? I mentioned this the other day, most of you guys watch during the week anyway, so you're not even gonna notice. But hey, you! Hey you! Okay. What? No. Okay. Okay. Oh, you're gonna get the ball? Yeah. You wanna go outside and play with it? Yeah. What? Yeah. yeah. Ready? Yeah. You're gonna bounce it? Yeah. Probably away from mommy, which means she'll have to go get it. Bounce, bounce, bounce. A rock? Yeah. Oh my goodness, what? Feet. Where's your knees? Where's your belly? Where's your... Need help? You got it? Yeah. Okay. Where's your eyes? Where's your ears? Where's your nose? Where's your mouth? Do you know where your mouth is? Mouth. Rock, rock. Can you show me where your hair is? Where's your hair? I guess we're done with our anatomy lesson. It has been a long weekend and she has not gotten as much sleep as she should. Uh, <laughs> I guess all of us haven't. All of us have not gotten as much sleep as we should. No. And so we are very, very tired today. So it is very apparent no. that we are going to have an early bedtime. She might not know it, but Mommy knows it. Are you going that night on Apollo? Yeah. Yeah? Did he know that? Can you tell Apollo you love him? Love you. <laughs> See, not, what's wrong, Tina? What's wrong? What happened? Girl, you want to go play with your kitchen? No. Do you want to go read a book? No. Do you want to color? No. You want to lay down? No. No. You don't want to do anything? Should we start making Dada's shirt? Yeah. You want to make Daddy's shirt? Yeah. I need ideas. I have some ideas for Father's Day. Do you have some ideas for Father's Day? No. No, you don't. Have you been thinking about it? <laughs> Have you been thinking about Father's Day? Yeah? What you want to do for Dada? Yeah. Yeah, you have? Do you have any ideas? Uppy. <laughs> Uppy? So if you have ideas, let me know. I have a few. But I'm not like super excited about any of them just yet, so I'm still looking, still putting my feelers out there. And it doesn't help that 
we have um, a party on Friday for work and I am making the goods. Well, not all of them, but a lot of them, a lot. And so you'll have to wait and see what it is. Um, I don't think my coworker watches this, but just in case, I don't wanna give away what it is. I'm excited to try it, kind of test my skills, venture out. It's gonna be fun, in my opinion. So watch for it probably Thursday. Red light. Um, why don't you tell everybody what we're doing and I want you to do it in the slowest voice that you can, but be excited while you're saying it. Cause then I'm gonna speed it up so you sound like a normal paced, excited person. You ready to eat some food? Yeah, daddy's starving too. Say some noodles. We are noodle folk. Baby chick loves her noodles. She used to hate them, but now we get these pan fried noodles from Chinese food. She loves them, just plain noodles. And sometimes we put some sauce on it, but she'll eat them plain. Mmm. <sighs> One of the best things about having a kid is you can buy Capri Suns and not feel like a total loser buying them because you can make oh they're for the kid but in all reality i bought capri suns long before we had baby chick in fact there was this one time uh that actually baby chick was born but she was only like a month or two old and we were at costco and we bought a big pack of capri suns and the guy was like oh are these for her and then ash was like no they're for my husband and he just gave me this like weird look and he's like Oh, that's cool. Trying to be like play it off, but I'm not gonna lie. I love Capri Suns. They're amazing, and I've loved them since forever. And they now have a Capri Sun big pouch, so that way you can get more than what is this? Two. This is like what four ounces or something. I don't know. It's something tiny. So I usually grab two of them. But anyways, uh, it was Bachelor Date Night tonight, and we were kind of disappointed because tonight was a stupid rerun episode. It was like previously on The Bachelor. And I know a lot of you don't care. It's like, okay, it's a stupid show. And yeah, it's a stupid show, but it's like me and Ashley, so it's what we do. It's our date night, it's our time alone. Baby Chick goes to bed and then we can actually be together and make fun of these people as one. But tonight was a rerun, so uh, that was kind of a bummer. But uh, we still had a fun night, we still hung out, we still ate our Chinese food. Mmm, Szechuan chicken is so delicious. Uh, but anyways, uh, I gotta admit, I had a amazing time doing uh, theme week and it was way, way more work than I was thinking it was going to be trying to come up with fun and creative things and it took so much more time to edit them, but I think they're awesome and I hope you guys enjoyed them. I mean, the people that have watched them said they really enjoyed them, uh, but I gotta admit, it is nice to just be able to do a normal vlog today. To not have to worry about saying stuff backwards or you know, editing it all funky. It'll be nice just to get back into the routine of things. So uh, it was fun, but I'm glad it's done. Uh, anyways, uh, thank you for watching today and thumbs up for Thai, actually not Thai food. <laughs> thumbs up for Chinese food and we'll see you guys all tomorrow. <gasps> Bye. Hello, I got some mood lighting going on here. We got the bright side, the dark side. All I need is some Venetian blind lighting and then I truly am in a noir film set. Uh, anyways, before we get started with today's vlog, I wanted to tell you guys quickly about this project I worked on a while ago called Dex Dixon Paranormal Dick. <laughs> it is a film noir horror comedy musical written by this guy named Steve Coker, who's one of my friends that I used to work with. Uh, anyways, uh, I helped shoot it and edit it and do all the visual effects on it and stuff. And it's actually